Am I a bad person? Because the, the more you didn't like it, the more I enjoyed it. I fucking loved how much you hated it. Turn me on. Why am I like that? Why? I am one of the most dangerous men on this planet. Sometimes you forget exactly how lucky you were to get fucked by me. Would you rather me pin you down and make you do things you didn't like, or would you rather fuck You didn't like that I was thinking I can do whatever I want to. That's what it is. I'm the smartest person on this fucking planet. Are you seriously so offended I strangled you a little bit? You didn't fucking pass out. Chill the fuck out. Jesus Christ, I thought you were cool. What's going on with all my billionaires out there? This the guy who is being there. Welcome to Hood's Being There TV. Big favor, big abundance on today's episode. We're going to be talking about. It looks like I was wrong about your boy Andrew Tate, man. Like, I'm one of the first people to admit when I'm wrong about some shit. Like, when I'm wrong, I'm wrong. I was wrong. It looks like I was wrong about Andrew Tate, bro. Like, uh,. I was supporting them. I definitely know it's. I still believe it's an attack on masculinity and masculine men. You know, they want all men to be more feminized. I still believe that. I still know that to be true. And even though a lot of shit Tate was saying was toxic, you know what I'm saying? It was that he did. He did promote a form of toxic masculinity. I will not lie, but. You know, a lot of stuff, he was saying a lot of stuff that was true in regards to men. Men should be focused. A man should be a man of focus. A man should be a man of wisdom. A man should be a leader. A man should be a protector. You know what I'm saying? A man should always be a thinker. A man should strategize. A man should, a man should, uh, you know, always just, just be a masculine man and be on his journey. Like a lot of the shit he said was real. And I agree with a hundred percent. I agree with a lot of shit. He's not all of the oh, I wouldn't fuck with a single mother, and you know, if she over twenty five, I wouldn't like that type of shit. Is toxic. I mean, I don't pay down that little shit like that no mind because that's not realistic to me. Like that's not. There are beautiful women that are single mothers. There are beautiful women over twenty five. Like that's. You see, that's where we differ. I'm the complete opposite. I wouldn't date a woman under twenty five. They don't know enough. They haven't been through enough. They don't know enough about life. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm not even... That type of shit don't do nothing to me. You feel what I'm saying? And I wouldn't want a woman... I wouldn't mind a woman that has a child. That doesn't bother me at all either. You feel what I'm saying? It, all, I'm really more focused on a woman that got vision for herself and her family. And just as an overall good person with a good spirit, a good human being. Like, all that other shit he was saying. Like, it's like, I don't agree with that. But he was saying a lot of real shit. So I was just feeling like, you know, oh, they after him because he kind of can be an asshole, but he promoting masculinity to, to, to lead a new age of masculine men. You feel what I'm saying? I see why they trying to bring him down. You feel what I'm saying? But looks like I was wrong. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, it looks like I was wrong. And I'm sorry about that. Like, definitely looks like I was wrong. Like. You know, that shit, that's your boy on audio talking about the R word with somebody. You feel what I'm saying? And I don't promote that at all. I don't promote doing anything against a woman's will at all. I don't promote hitting women. You know what I'm saying? I don't promote no type of, I don't promote nothing. I don't promote verbal abuse to no woman. If a woman is going off where I feel like I had to verbally abuse her, I just won't deal with her. You feel what I'm saying? I'm not dealing with nothing toxic, period. Woman start be if she start being verbally abusive, I'm just gonna cut her off. Soon as you show me the signs that you can be verbally abusive, I'm not finna be ver I'm not finna match that energy. I'm not finna I'm definitely not finna put no hands on you. I'm just finna not fuck with you, period. Like that's it. Like it's over right then and there. Like, bam, we cut. You know what I'm saying? You should be grown enough to be able to mind your tongue. So when it's like that, you gotta just, you gotta, you know, you gotta know how to operate as a man. You can't preach masculinity and then you talking about taking something from a woman. I definitely don't agree with that. I definitely don't agree with no type of forced anything when it comes to a woman. You feel what I'm saying? So, for me to hear him say that and then just all of the other evidence coming out. I mean, it pretty much looked like you was pimping, bro. Like, you was running a pimp. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You was running a prostitution ring pretty much for the most part. You know what I'm saying? You was virtual pimping. That's all it was. You was virtual pimping. You was pimping in the virtual space. 
You know what I'm saying? And it looked like you was gorilla pimping on top of that. You wasn't even just like finesse pimping. You gorilla pimping. You 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 know what I'm saying? You doing the R word on chicks and you you know what I'm saying? Choking motherfuckers and I'm sure you done put your hands on a couple females. You you talked about it. You said sometimes you might have to put your hands on them like damn like that's it's just it's fucked up because it's like man i didn't you know i was supportive of andrew you know i fuck with the top g you know what I'm i can't even call you the top g no more nigga like that's some little g shit you know what i'm saying that's some little g can't call you the top g you the little g if you out here doing the r word my guy you out here you know doing shit against women's will I can't, I can't fuck with that. I can't promote that at all. You feel what I'm saying? Nigga, that's your voice. And then when you look at all the different clips of this nigga saying this type of shit out his own mouth. You holding women against they will. You doing shit against they will. You, it's like, bro, this is you. You had like a, like a superiority complex. You feel what I'm saying? You can tell when a nigga got a superiority complex. So, I mean, damn, it is what it is, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Like... Whatever you got to deal with on that is what you got to deal with on that. I really don't got nothing to do with that or got nothing to say about that, man. That's your own personal battles and your own personal shit. So, I don't got no connection to that, man. I hope, I Hopefully, you figure that out. And, and, and You know, whatever you got to go through based on that is what you got to go through, my guy. But it is what it is, man. It's the God who is being there. Big favor, big abundance. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. It's the God who is being there. Big favor, big abundance. I'm gone.